miracles Dr. Pym promised. Hello, hello, I'm Alice Cowboy. I'm, uh, Welcome back to Marvel Avengers. So what exactly is this Starboost thing? Meet me in the tech lab, kid, and see for yourself. I am quite eager to see this um, new suit of Tony's. His suit, his new suits have always got um, an interest for me. This is um, a, a suit apparently that can go into space now that he, he's got the pim cut particles from Hank. Cool. That looks awesome. Because it is awesome. One point four billion dollar vanity project. I may incinerate on takeoff, but I'll look damn good doing it. All systems are in the green, sir. But I must warn you, a large storm system has moved into your direct flight path. Never rains, but it pours. Well, we can't wait any longer. Tony, I loaded up some music to give you a little boost. Oh, no. Don't worry, it's not mine. You oh, can do this. Please be tiny, dancer. Go on, okay. that would be that be funny if um, she, Three, that two. was a music he had to listen to. <laughs> I guess the music she chose is pretty in keeping with his taste. Tony, you're flying right into the storm Although I've got the music volume down, so that you can hear. Oh, um. Bruce talking. Perfect lighting. By the way, that the lights on the console over here are Damn it. just Not swirling around. Like Hopefully, this place isn't crawling with guards. Of course, it's going to be crawling with guards. Okay, let's see what we got. Wait a minute. Well, this doesn't make sense. <laughs> Regenerative formula. That'll explain Tarleton's giant head. That's its source. Probably some unfortunate inhuman. Okay, let's find that door. No sweat. Rescue that inhuman. No more regen formula. No more adaptoids. High fives all around. Not 
that though. Is that comic? Covered in space dust. This place does not get a lot of foot traffic. Just a little hack to this next door without waking anybody up. This place does seem remarkably lacking in opposition. Um, <laughs> maybe they just figure it being up in space, nobody's likely to get there, so they don't need defenses. Unauthorized life form detected. Oh, hey, you mean me. Pretty well. If that didn't wake up the robo guards, I'm not sure anything will. Ah. Sorry, it took me a. Uh... A minute to work that one out. Sometimes I'm a little slow on the uptake. Crashing through their airlock didn't wake up the robot guard dogs. Maybe they're here to keep something in, not out. That's pretty cool. I don't know what it is, but it's pretty cool. Oh no. That's not ominous at all. You're alive. Tony. What are you... What is all this stuff? Where am I? No. Yes. Tony? Are you hugging me? I don't know. I just didn't watch it fall. Then why aren't you letting go? I just... We thought... I mean, I thought that... Good to have you back, Captain. I'm so confused. Yeah, come on. <laughs> Gotta get you out of here. Come on. Wait, 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 wait. Tarleton. Did he survive? Tarleton? Who cares? What? The explosion, he was too close. He survived. Thanks to you, apparently. And Monica, if you believe the news stories. That doesn't make sense. <coughs> okay, I got gotcha. you. The evacuation. All those people. Yeah, we'll get to that. You think you can walk? Yeah, it's okay. I'm good. Let's do this. Well, there's the cap, I remember. Come on. Okay. What's the plan? Uh, well, we find an escape pod and, uh, escape. You're winging this, aren't you? Yes. Yes, I am. Actually, didn't think I'd make it this far. <laughs> Tony, where is everyone? Where's here? Oh, well, we're in space. My god. You weren't kidding. Nope. <laughs> wow. Like riding a bike, I guess. Yeah, once you tried it without the saddle, you never forget how jump? the bell works. Tony. 
What's... What's happening? Well, it's a long story. <clears throat> to get back up here and roll with it. How long was I? Ah, well, five years. Which, by your standards, is just a power nap. I'm starting to think people just prefer me on ice. See? You're already making jokes. Corny ones, but that's normal for you. Have somebody his age. Sorry, I was just uh, thought I saw uh, a white indicator that um, there was something there. Captain Rogers, what is this? Don't leave us just yet. Monica, long time no see. Can't imagine your buddy Tarleton was too thrilled about using superhero blood to replace superheroes. He leaves the details to me. Stop what you're doing now. Wait a minute. Georgie doesn't know about any of this. And he never will. Self-destruct beacon initiated. Uh-oh. I think we made her mad. Tony! I'm working on it! All right, got it. Let's go! What the hell? Oh, don't mind the killer robots. Hurry! Get it open! I'm trying! For a dead guy, you're really pushy. I'm gonna have to brute force this thing. Why didn't you start with that? the other side. It's not his regular shield, but he still made man to make it work. Just lost the engines, Tony. Uh, yeah, yeah, we get it. Shit. is we're not gonna die in a fiery ball of death. And the bad news? We'll uh, most likely suffocate first. Ah. Well, at least it's a good view. Yeah. That it is. That is a very good view. Damn it. So close. Miss Thor. Well, well, actually, we're gonna the die anyway. portal yeah, guys. I don't know, last confessions? Your jokes. I just don't get them. I know I read your diary. <laughs> Good line. Why'd you smash the reactor cap? A lot of people died. Tony. 
Tony, there was something buried deep beneath the bay. Somehow linked to the reactor, working its way to the surface every minute. The earthquake? I had to do something. The entire San Andreas Fault was about to blow. The ocean would have consumed the city. Millions would have died. Never doubted you for a second. Just had to hear it, you know? What the hell is that? Oh. Well, look who it is. Am I always going to save the day? I expect nothing less from the God of Thunder. Hi, Thor. Welcome back, Captain. She's in trouble now. This was your regenerative formula. George? How long have I been your lab rat? I knew you'd react like this. You'd rather die than need something from them. I trusted you. you saved your life. You can control machines with your mind. Just think of you all the... You infected me with his blood. It could have killed me. But it didn't. Remember the dream, George. How could you make me one of them? I made you strong. You stole my hope. And now, I am going to give you the same odds that I had. Ha-ha. <laughs> what have you done? I will rid the Earth of superpowers. Even if it has to end with me. Good to see you. Listen, if I had known you were alive, that they had you. This isn't on you. Tarleton didn't even know Monica had me. What? A-Day. The heist. Monica hired Taskmaster to steal a Terrigen crystal. His men triggered the security protocols, initiating the Chimera's autopilot. But that thing in the bay, that was unexpected. The heat signal. It must have been what caused the earthquake that took down the city. What was that? I don't know. Nat, I'd, I just keep thinking. If I hadn't, all those people. No, this is not your fault. That ship was never supposed to be in the air. I would have done the same thing. You're alive. I knew it. I'm sorry. Um, come on. You should really see this. Well, the gang's all here. With a spare. Welcome back, Captain Rogers. I know I speak for everyone when I say that you are a sight for sore eyes. Thanks, Jarvis. It's good to be back. Since the Chimera's near crash into Manhattan, the situation has become dire. I fear AIM will use this as an opportunity to ramp up their persecution of all the Inhumans. 
We can't let that happen. The world needs the Avengers now more than ever. Well, that was a plot twist. I mean, it wasn't an entirely unexpected one because uh, I had a sneaky suspicion that Captain Rogers, you know, Captain America was going to get back in the game somehow. But I like the way they did it with um, the double cross going on. Um, I'm interested to see where that's going to, what the fallout from that's going to be. But anyway, I had a Marvel Skyboy. Thanks for watching. Until next time. Happy trails.